All right, get, get everything ratcheted back up because we're looking. We got 13 days until these teams get their rookie report dates for 2023's training camp. The Falcons, Ravens, Bills, Chiefs, Chargers, Dolphins, Saints, Giants, 49ers. So it's less than two weeks. 13, less than two weeks. My, my math's normally bad. It's, it's good there. We're going to get all these teams from training camp. What's the biggest story, Steve, that you are looking forward to? Well, to me, I'm moving beyond the rookies, and that's Trey Lance in the 49ers quarterback situation because Trey Lance, this time last year, guys, he was the guy. Everybody up in Santa Clara was saying he's going to be our starter. He's going to take us to the next level with this great defense. Now people are wondering if he's going to be able to hold off Brock Purdy, who's coming off that elbow, that elbow surgery, not hold him off, I should say, if he's going to be able to supplant him because you've heard all offseason from Kyle Shanahan and general manager John Lynch that Brock Purdy's the guy who showed it in games and has got everybody's trust. But the reports from this offseason that Trey Lance has had good offseason work. He looks really good. Yeah, Sam Darnold could be pushing him a little bit as well. But I think Trey Lance, again, a guy who was supposed to be the starter last year, I'm asking, did he get worse? Why isn't he really being considered right now with Brock Purdy? We don't know his health situation as somebody who could step right in and, 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 and enable the trust. So, David, I think this is going to be a big storyline because some people say, oh, the Niners can put any quarterback back there. We've seen before they can't. And I think if Trey Lance comes out and plays well, he can make things real interesting in training camp up there. Uh, it's going to be incredibly interesting. I, I'm, I'm glued into the TV and, and our news coverage as we watch this thing unfold because Sam Darnold, like you mentioned, he's, a, he's in the mix as well. So I'm, I'm pulling for Trey. Hopefully he comes back and makes, makes something happen because he deserves to be the guy. I think he's, he's got some crazy talent. Kyle Shanahan wouldn't have made that happen if he didn't believe he did.